Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. And in this video, I'm gonna talk about localization or translation service in WordPress. So in this channel previously, I showed you how to translate WordPress or WP Event Manager using uh, the translate.wordpress.org or WPML or like uh, the PO edit. So today we're not gonna use any external software or services. So instead we're gonna use one plugin that's available in WordPress plugin repository. And we're gonna use that to translate our WordPress inside into a certain level okay so this will be a purely functional based demonstration not a guide so you can follow this guide uh, or the tutorial to translate your own website as per your need all right so firstly we're going to go to plugins repository and we're going to add a plugin named loco translate okay so search for loco translate okay and we're going to hit enter and the plugin we need is this one translation manager loco translate okay and we're gonna click on install now then when it does uh, like completes installing we're gonna click on activate so after installing you will find loco translate on your sidebar over here okay so let's go over there and over here we're gonna see how we can translate the uh, PO files that provided with our WP event manager and we're gonna translate it to some other language rather than the English one okay so pretty simple actually and active theme is event listing so the theme we are using over here and all the plugins that's active right now uh, are listed over here as well okay so we're gonna choose uh, the WP event manager over here as the bundle name okay and we're gonna go inside then translate the files right so after going inside, you will find like all the PO files that been already included with WP Event Manager. And this PO files, we already uh, like showed a demonstration with PO edit in uh, previously in this channel. Feel free to uh, watch that video for guidance if you are using PO edit to like make translations and all. But this is local translate and we're gonna show you how to like uh, translate the, or like edit the PO files with local translate, okay? So uh, we're going to translate the Bengali version, okay? Um, it's not like really necessary that you do that. You want to like uh, modify or edit the PO file that matches your uh, like target language, okay? So if your uh, base site is on English, you want to like let's say modify the PO file for Spanish or like let's say French, you can do that as well, okay? For myself, my... Uh, native language is Bengali uh, Indian Bengali to be exact and Indian Bengali is not a PO file that's been included over here but we can use the Bengali over here right so what you can do we can click on over here and it will take us to the PO editor okay so pretty simple so follow my lead over here and we're gonna translate our file or the PO file to be exact right so in this list, you will find all the source text that's been used by WP Event Manager and you will be able to modify each text as well with your own translation. So by default, these are community translations over here, as you can see, and these translations you can override as well. So you can use PO edit or you can use local edit as well. So let's say uh, if we want to uh, change one uh, string over here, let's say this edit listing one, all right? And what you can do, you can see the source text over here that says edit listing. You cannot edit that, but instead you can modify the uh, translation language you are targeting, okay? So I'm targeting the Bengali one. This is the Bengali version of the edit listing. And we're gonna modify this uh, to, uh, let's say, something different okay so i have my translations copied to my clipboard so instead of this edit over here so this actually barely translate to edit listing edit um I'm, I'm gonna like type in the pure bengali version of the edit so that's uh, actually translate to shampadona i'm not sure if you would understand that but anyway i'm gonna paste it over here all right and we can click on save over here C click this button and that will go ahead and update our PO file with our desired translation edit, right? So you see over here, we have the same uh, translation that we provided over here, right? So we can even modify it to greater extent, like providing custom translation and all. You can modify every single string over here, like a lot of strings are available. You can even search or like filter uh, translations over here as well. And when you are done, like updating your translation, just click save and that will save your PO file. So 
this being an introduction video about how to modify PO files or how to edit translations using local translate in a WordPress environment. So this is not uh, like limited to WP event manager. Local translate will allow you to translate or like edit every PO file that uh, is like present in the WordPress environment, right? So it can be a theme, it can be a plugin, uh, it can be other plugins as well. It can be WordPress core uh, translations as well, right? So feel free to explore Loco Translate. It's a good tool and it has a free version as well. Let me know in the comment what you think of this video. If you found it useful, leave a like, leave a comment, leave some suggestions maybe. So until then, I'm saying goodbye. I'll see you again in another video some other time. <music>